I'm Dr. Frank Newport, Editor-in-Chief of the Gallup Poll. This is the Daily Briefing for Monday, July the 30th. Gallup looks at the relationship between race and support for the death penalty. Let's go back in time for a while. Imagine it is 1936, in the middle of the Depression. George Gallup, here at the Gallup Poll, asks a sample of Americans, do they favor or oppose the death penalty for persons convicted of murder? The answer way back then, 59% yes, 38% no. Now let's fast forward to today. We just got through a month or two ago asking Americans this exact same question. What do we find? 65% of Americans say yes, 31% say no. Really not a lot of change comparing 1936 to 2007. Now, between those two points in time, however, there has been a lot of change. Support for the death penalty has gone down and it has gone up. For example, there was a period of time in the 1960s when as many or more Americans opposed the death penalty as favored it. This was the point in time at which death penalty executions were outlawed. But over the last several decades, we have a clear majority of Americans who poll after poll have said they favored the death penalty for persons convicted of murder. There's been a lot of interest in the relationship between race and support for the death penalty. In part, that's because death row is disproportionately populated with African Americans and those executed are disproportionately African American in this country. Look at the data. Majority of blacks in America today opposed to the death penalty. Look at whites, a significant majority are in favor of the death penalty. What about Hispanics? Well, they're somewhere in the middle. 48% of Hispanics favored, 49% are opposed. Bottom line here is support for the death penalty very significantly related to one's race in this country today. Whites fairly overwhelmingly supported, blacks strongly opposed. Join us tomorrow for an update from a new Gallup poll. I'm Dr. Frank Newport, Editor-in-Chief of the Gallup Poll with Democracy on Demand.